Thomas Eberle, national team head coach. Um, the men's national team played two matches in March friendly with Hungary and a qualification mat match against Austria. Mm, what is your summary uh, of the March gathering? Yeah, of course, uh, the results are the most important, especially for the second game. And this was uh, at the end uh, disappointed. Uh, but of course, we have uh, two two aims as well. We wanted to give opportunities for players to play the first game, friendly game, which will be the last till October. Then we will play again a friendly game. So we wanted to give really minutes for other players to see how strong our part they are, and we get some uh, good uh, information. And uh, but as well, not 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 we don't want this 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 game. So uh, yeah. But performance-wise, I think we wanted to do a step. We wanted to be really uh, uh, aggressive. We wanted to to have more ball position than maybe before against such strong teams. And uh, when I look back to the Austrian game, I think uh, after 88 minutes, it, we were really close. When we when I saw after the game the Austrian uh, Austrian players, they were really shattered. They were really mentally, emotional. Uh, close to at the end so that means uh, we yeah they couldn't expect us also so I think in overall performance wise was really good but uh, of course we need points what were the specific details that you were satisfied with on side and off side the pitch yeah we wanted to be brave and we know that this is as well a risk against this team who has uh, a lot of power a lot of uh, skills in winning duels and we wanted to, to go full in uh, as well and uh, we, we struggled a little bit uh, at the beginning to get adapted with the rhythm so that normally we can uh, we could play cash but we were in this two situation where Haim or, or, or the penalties the uh, yeah the, the luck was on our side or we were successful that they didn't score how depends how you want to see it and then, uh, yeah, we, 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 we tried to be in to get all those opportunities. We played with two strikers. We have had a number 10. We, 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 Simiowski is an often player. Then the midfielder are eight. So uh, we wanted really to play as well football. And uh, of course, it's really difficult against this, this strong team. And uh, yeah, we tried the best. And when I saw how much they run, how high the intensity was, especially like uh, uh, Vasilier for or. Uh, Kate or Sinyavsky, they have uh, high numbers in speed and high numbers in running. And uh, as well, Senio, till the end, that shows really uh, we, we have uh, made uh, a good performance. But of course, it's it was not enough to, to get points away against Austria. Uh, I'm in one point as well, a little bit happy that we can speak about uh, that we were close. But on the other hand, of course, it's... Uh, it's a disappointment that, that we saw as well in the players' face. It's I think it's different than maybe two years ago where we were as well happy and we lost. This time it was really oh, difficult to discuss, uh, to to digest. What must be done to bring bring uh, performance and success together? Yeah, keep the the the, the emotion load and 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 uh, the belief till the end that we get a uh, certain calmness. We know it will be a situation that we have to to fight. That it will be difficult, but we we keep uh, calm emotions, calm mind, and 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 uh, yeah, believe till the end. I we change. I change the striker because I really hope that we can make the lucky punch. Uh, so that shows, uh, yeah, we, we were not so under pressure uh, when we conceded the last goal. So, uh, yeah, we have to, to believe, get good emotions in the club. Uh, I think some players that are really successful in the club and I think this, this confidence they have to bring to the team that we can really keep it till the end. And uh, now we're looking ahead of June. How would you describe our upcoming opponents, Azerbaijan and, and Belgium? Yeah, this uh, the second away game, so it can be can be tough in, in Azerbaijan because we can be really really hot. So we need to be well prepared. Of course, we want to perform like like in Astro uh, against Austria, <laughs> and uh, yeah, it will be different than than Belgium. That will be our first uh, home game. But we really hope of uh, a lot 
of support. Uh, we have seen in, 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 in Austria how it is to play with, with, with the support of, of, of the fans and uh, I'm sure uh, against Belgium uh, the stadium will be full and uh, the Estonian will uh, support us. Uh, so it will be th two, two great games, two totally different tasks, uh, but uh, yeah, we need to wait two months, but we will be ready.